And those strong winds that Pat just mentioned, well, the Santa Ana winds are howling across most of Southern California tonight as temperatures start to drop and rain is heading our way. We have team coverage for you tonight, beginning with CBS 2's Jeff Nguyen. He's live in Lebec. Jeff. Well, I-5 is right behind me right now, and traffic has been pretty light over the last hour or so, perhaps because it is really cold in the high 30s right now and awfully windy. You can see how, because the movement of that tree right there, and as you look across this parking lot, a ton of big rigs have pulled over for the night, and get this, things are expected to be much worse for the holiday commute. Listen to the wind roar as we headed up the grapevine tonight. A number of times we saw debris flying across the I-5. So did Sean Rosales and his wife, Stephanie. Their car bears some of the evidence. There was a tumbleweed, like, it was huge, and uh, there was no way of avoiding it. The tumbleweeds are flying over here, and when we're on the freeway, when the car was swinging back and forth, they're flying in front of the cars, over the cars. They're just flying everywhere. The strong winds were too much for long haul truck drivers like Martin Cripple. He decided to get off the road tonight because his 18 wheeler had been rocking. I don't think you blow over with you, you know, with the full load. But empty, that's is a good chance to blow over, and and it's just dangerous. Oh my gosh, it's so cold. <laughs> the Ingraham family is going back to Sacramento. They decided to do a quick trip to Southern California before the holiday traffic jam. With rain in the forecast, Sean and Stephanie Rosales have been warning their friends and family who are coming over for Thanksgiving. We kind of let them know, you know, uh, either come up ahead of time if they can, and if not, just be prepared for the worst. Here in Southern California, AAA says that the worst time to travel for Thanksgiving will be between 5 and 7 p.m. on Wednesday. So be prepared to plan ahead. For now, we're live in Lebec. Jeff Nguyen, CBS2 News.